This is only um, one month. Food vouchers, rent relief and financial counselling. Demand has never been higher for the supports provided by the Jacaranda Community Centre in Perth. Rent arrears there. There's all sorts of things that we might, school uniforms we might help with. CEO Lindsay Fitzgerald says her staff are seeing a lot of new faces and it's only going to get worse. They may not have needed the help before, but they're definitely going to need it this year. The interest rate rise is putting a squeeze on the budgets of West Australians already being stretched. That's because Western Australia has the highest inflation rate uh, in the country at 7.6%. WA also has the lowest wage growth of all the states at 2.2%. So we've got this growing cost of living issue that we've kind of seen bubbling along for a while now, and it's really just in focus now. Um, it's going to be finding that extra $80 per month, essentially, out of what we're already spending, uh, especially with the cost of everything going up. Every day you wake up, there are price increases. Yeah, it's, it's going to be a little bit hard, but yeah, what can we do? And while not everyone in WA is doing it tough, even those with investment properties will seek to cover their rising repayments. So that's going to mean that rentals will go up as well. It's not just about interest for a mortgage. And it's a flow-on effect. Once a week, this centre hands out food packages. And lately, when they do, the queue of people stretches right down the footpath, more than 30 people long. Also growing longer, the list of people seeking domestic violence support. And it's going to get worse as these prices go up. It always does when we have any increases. Lindsay Fitzgerald fearing a long winter ahead. James Carmody, ABC News.